Coming up, Lady Gaga scores the first number one of 2010. Frankie from the Saturdays has trouble speaking. Every time I say it, it comes out wrong. Eagle. 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 Our sound garden ready for a comeback. Yeah, I think it should be interesting. And monkey Alex Turner is not as well dressed as a vampire and take that. Well, Happy New Year all, and poor little Joe McKeldry, first Rage Against the Machine, rob him of the Christmas number one. And now Lady Gaga has only gone and ended his one week reign at the top of the singles chart. Yes, the X Factor winner was slammed down big time as Gaga's bad romance swept to number one just days after news her other single, Poker Face, was the biggest selling song of 2009, shifting over 880,000 copies. Thanks for having me. Next, the Saturdays release their latest single, Ego, today. Ego. Get your teeth in, Frankie, that's Ego. And despite them being all gorgeous and a little bit manufactured, the girls told me they're no fans of lip syncing. In fact, the very mention of it gets them fuming. Oh, no, we, no. we hate that. I don't think you can get away with it now. No, no. for some TV shows, you have to make the own exception because they're not like, that's what we told you can't do it. In some environments, but we always have a passive drop, don't we? <laughs> Looking back over the noughties, it's like who didn't make a comeback? Well, the next in line could be legendary grunge rockers Soundgarden. Frontman Chris Cornell's written words on the band's website, which suggests the guys who fell out back in 1997 could be set to reform. The message reads, the 12 year break is over and school is back in session. Andy probably does look good on the dance floor, but not good enough, it seems, to beat hot vampire Robert Pattinson and old boys done well, take that. Yes, despite having the fine accessory Alexa Chung on his arm, Arctic Monkey Alex Turner has only managed third place on GQ's best dress list. Good news is he did beat fantastic Mr Fox, who came in fourth. What kind of a poll is this? Anyway, that's it for today. I'll see you tomorrow.